Good afternoon. Hello. It's time for us. We're so Stay glad up. to be there today, here today. It has been a wonderful day and we have just looked so forward just to sit down and just have some time with y'all. Yes. So just get comfortable and we'll just make something pretty today. I'm Vonda, yes. this is Paula, Hi. and we're Scripture DIY. Yes. And we are still in the Thanksgiving mode. Yes. So we are. today we are going to make pumpkins. So there's my mom. Hello. Hey, Mom. So what we're going to do first is we have taken these little plastic um, jack-o'-lanterns that little kids yeah. carry. It has, yeah, yeah. this one was green, mm -hmm. um, that they carry trick-or-treating. Right. They have the little handle on there, and they carry them, and they get their little candy. Fill like this sucker full of candy. the handles off. Yes, we did. Yes. And so we took some Krylon yellow spray paint mm -hmm. and we sprayed the whole thing to cover it. Yes. Now, we're not into Halloween. No. We're into Thanksgiving. Yes. So we are going to use the back side yes. to make our pumpkins yep. today. So if you are a master crafter and you are just a whiz at making stuff, we're glad you're here. We hope to get you thinking about what you're going to make for your Thanksgiving uh, decorations. If you don't think you're a craftsman at all, you yes, got you are. thing coming. Yes. Hey, Mary Kay. Hey. We are going to show you that you can craft, make some really, really <coughs> cute stuff, mm -hmm. and it not cost hardly anything also. Right. So we started out, these were a dollar a piece. Mm -hmm. This is probably one of our most expensive things because we actually paid $3 That's for, right. for our we craft. Have three of Because we have three yes. of them. Yes. So what we're going to do yeah. is we also cut out some stencils that say thankful, grateful, and, and blessed. blessed. All right. So yes. that's what we're going to do first. Right. And then we will start gluing them together. Yes. Now, um, we've already got bless done. Yes. And Paula has gravel. Yes, I do. I have a bag of the little decorative gravels. Now, you know how we save everything. So, some of it, these are leftovers. Um, you can get these little bags of gravels like this at the Dollar Tree. So, a bag of the gravel is a dollar. Um, you can also get it at... Hobby Lobby, Michaels, and Walmart too. Or you know what? I started to just use dirt. Yeah. Because yes. all you're wanting, honestly, all yes. you're wanting on here is just something to hold it down yeah. because it's going to get top heavy. So your, your bottom pumpkin is going to need some rocks in the bottom. So you can actually just go out and if you have rocks on your property, just get some heavy rocks and put down in the bottom of your bottom pumpkin. It's just going to keep it from blowing away or especially toppling you, over because yeah, it's going to be top over. heavy yeah especially if you're going to use this out on your front porch or your back porch or somewhere yeah. or in your house you just don't want it to topple over well and it's going to be yeah. glued so it's going yes. to seal in the dirt or the grocks or yes. whatever you use yeah whatever you use you're not going to have it ever again we so. just grabbed this gravel because we had yeah. some left over yeah Plus, um, it, it's been reused and reused. Yeah, so. it's about time to throw it away. <laughs> yeah, so like we yeah. said, we reuse things, so that's definitely what we're doing with this. So I'm going to put this in um, the bottom of our bottom pumpkin. That's our top one. Is this our bottom one, the blessed? The blessed is the bottom. Yeah, blessed is the bottom. See, I already forgot. Thankful, grace, grateful, and blessed. Yes. So we're just going to put some in the bottom. Okay. Normally we would have put a stencil on here and painted it, yes. but you have to be kind of easy because the um, paint, we probably should have used um, um, yeah, primer first. So if you do these, um, put a primer on them first and then spray paint them because yeah, they are kind of shiny coated with um, I don't, how do you say that? Um, they've got a shiny coating on the outside of them. So primer them and then spray paint then them spray with your paint. favorite color. Yeah. Yes. Um, because also it took me about three coats to get over. Even though it was the light green, 
Yeah. So I was kind of bummed out when I first picked them up because there was no orange ones. But now I'm kind of glad. The yes. Lord knew what he was doing on that. Yes, he did. Because yes. that one is turning out. Yeah. So just get it, get yourself, um, or you may already have it, um, a good spray, in a spray can, primer. Or if you don't, you know, if you've got primer in a paint can, you can use that too. I think Spray we hands. had Krylon. Wasn't it Krylon? Yes, did yes we, have we did, Krylon? and we didn't use it. We should have. So, you can always learn from our mistakes. <laughs> I didn't have Paula here to tell me. Uh, no, no, usually <laughs> it would be me being the one to make the mistake. But, um, anyway, yes, so, so either spray paint with a primer, or you can use a regular primer in a can and, and brush it on, and then the easiest way is to, to um, spray these. Yeah. I think that's enough. That's enough to just to, it all from, you need is just, just enough in there to keep it from falling over. over. Yeah. That's right. Okay, and then we are going to, um, and since we're going to use E6000 to glue these together, and I'm going to start on the rim and leave a little space um, every now and then for hot glue because we're going to use both, like we told you guys a bunch of times, um, because the hot glue will eventually come apart if you use it outside, especially. So we're gonna use both, but we want the hot glue so that it sticks right off the bat. The hot glue is gonna do what we want right yes. now. Yes. Okay. Okay, so I'm gonna start. That's fine, I was looking for this one. Yeah. Okay, go for it. Okay. Start with a little line. And with the, e, uh, with the E6000, and you probably know, but um, it likes to cure first before you do yeah. anything with it. So if it takes you a long time to go around, that's okay. That's good because it actually is helping it out yeah. by just it doing it slowly. Because the more air it gets, the stickier yes. it seems to get. Yeah. And then once the the hot glue sets it, um, then we're we're good to go. So I'm going to hand that one so to her. So that's what we're going to do next. Yep. And then I'll start on this one. Okay. Okay. And this would be cute anywhere if you've got a front porch. Um, this would be really cute on a front porch. Um, I like stuff like that on the uh, fireplace. If you've got a nice little place on the fireplace. I'm sorry I had disappeared from you there for a minute. that one okay and we're just gonna pile it on top here mm -hmm. and let's make sure our we'll words look nice okay and then I'm gonna start with this one yeah ah, just put my hands all over what you just did it's okay so I'm sticky oh this one doesn't need it on top no it doesn't oh I'm Oops. sorry I wasn't paying attention see Gotta watch I me. was busy sticking my hands in the you glue. You gotta watch me because I get carried away with glue. I get carried away with paint and glue. <laughs> she knows. She knows she's gotta keep an eye on me. Okay, so you only have to glue two of them. <laughs> okay. Okay, yeah, I get carried away with paint and glue. Seriously. Okay. Now, and they just sit really nicely on top of each other. Okay. And we're just gonna give them just a second. Okay, this one I think you need to light Does it up. Does it need to line up better? Yeah. Oh, there, there, right down there. In there. Yeah. That's much better. Okay. All right. Yeah. All righty then. Now, we're going to let that set a minute because yep. Paula has got some words for us. Yeah, so if you guys looked at the scripture of the day today on our page, so it was from Proverbs. And who doesn't love Proverbs? Because it's honestly, like I've said many, many times, um, God's word is alive. We all know that and living. And it is honestly. Um, it is for today. Some people try to say that, well, that's an old book and it doesn't pertain today to today, but it does. It it's is, a guideline for how you should live yeah, your life. Yeah, it's a guidebook for how you should live our life and especially Proverbs. Um, there's so much good stuff in Proverbs and that's where our verse comes from for today. It's Proverbs 27, 5 and um, it says, better is open rebuke than hidden love. And if you read all of Proverbs 20, chapter 27, it's a lot of it talks about friendship. Um, and that's what it's talking about is um, friendship. And, and, and so 
that brought me around to other verses in the Bible about friendship, about true friendship. Um, and a lot of them are from Proverbs. And um, for example, Proverbs 12, 26, the godly give good advice to their friends, the wicked lead them astray. So think about your friends. Um, I am not about, going to lead you astray. That's right. We talked about this earlier today. So, if you have spinach in your teeth, would your friends tell you? <laughs> yes. That's true. Yes. If you had a little something in your nose, would your friend tell you? Your good friends should tell you. Yes. Um, so, it's little things like that. Um, if your button came undone or your zipper undone, your friend should tell you. You know? That's, that's this kind of stuff. Um, and then, Proverbs um, 22 we had, um, there's a lot, there's so many good ones in here. 22, 24 through 25. Um, oh, definitely a good one. Do not make friends with a hot tempered person. Do not associate with one easily angered or you may learn their ways and get yourself ensnared. So that's really good advice. I think bad rubs off on, on good a whole lot easier than, than good, on good bad. rubs off on bad. Yeah. It's just been my experience. Yeah. Um, I think when I was younger, I used to think the opposite when I was really young. Like, oh, I can help them change. I can help them be better. It's not true. It is so <laughs> not true. I learned the hard way. It's so not true. Um, Trust me, I learned the hard way. Um, Proverbs 27, 17 um, is really good. This is one I know we've all heard many times. As iron sharpens iron, so one person sharpens another. And that definitely goes for friendship. Um, we keep each other sharp. We keep each other on our toes. And that's what a good friend does. Um, and then in the New Testament, I know we've heard of this one before too, John 15, 13 through 15, there is no greater love than to lay down one's life for one's friends. And that was Jesus talking. So that's real friendship. That is good. That's yeah. very good. And yeah. really, really good friends are hard to find. Yes, they are. Um, you know, you, you hear about people who have huge groups of friends, um, but you know, if you... Um, test those friends against God's word. Are they really good friends? You know, that's right. Because true friends, um, I think Jesus had his twelve disciples. Those were good friends. Yeah. So, yeah. He did. Yeah. Okay. So while this was drying, I'm ta yeah. I'm taking some jute rope, mm -hmm. and all we're doing is we're just going around this part here in the center and we're just yeah. gonna all we're doing really is just cover up the the gap the gap the yeah. ugly right covering so, up the gap making so it pretty right. in between yeah so we're finding the middle of the jute like your friends cover up the gap for you there you go yeah, the jute rope, and then jute rope covers up the gap yeah put it right here yeah yeah so now we're basically just um Use your imagination to make it pretty. Um, yeah, if you, you had some good rope. You know what, if you'll hold that steel right there, I'm yeah. gonna go get some more glue because I'm using a lot more than I thought I was. Okay. Yeah. We're gonna get another glue stick. And what about you guys? Do you have any other verses that you are your favorites about friends in the Bible? As far as Our friends friend in the Bible, you know, Jonathan was an amazing friend to David. Oh, yeah. He, for sure. Um, he told it like it is, too. And what was the yes. guy's name? Was it Nathaniel that told David that he was messing up? I think so. When he, um, yeah. when he was uh, messing with, was that with the lady. With, Here, I need was it. That, was that Bathsheba? Yeah, yes. yeah, and he yes. told them, you know, what about, what about the sheep? You know, if somebody took your yes. sheep. We you have a very good friend that I know that I can always count on that she will tell me exactly like it is, and um, that means the world to me. Her name is Anne. 
Mm -hmm. And I love her dearly. Uh, she is a good lady. She, I can always count on her to tell me exactly like it is. And I just really admire that about her. So. Okay. If you're watching, Ann, love you. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, so far, it looks kind of... Now, that, that looks better for you, doesn't it? Yeah. So we've got grateful, thankful, and blessed. Yes. We've got to decorate it up a little bit somehow. Yes. We need to make it look really pretty. <laughs> so, and I'm give rubbing it, off on her. Did you hear that? I know. She's rubbing off on me. we got to give it some bling. Yes. I'm rubbing off on her. She wants to put some bling on it. So just to, we've got sacks we've got of some all these leaves. Really shiny, pretty leaves. Yes. Yes, Gli oh, so. glittery leaves. Oh my gosh, glitter. Glitter, there's <laughs> glitter on these leaves. I don't know if you guys can see that. Okay, y'all, she's yeah. talking me into a little bit of glitter. Yeah. Just awesome. a little bit. That's awesome. Um, yeah. But we do need to add some color because this yes. is pretty it's very, it's very plain. bland. Yeah, so we've got to, okay. we've got to pretty it up. Yeah. Okay, so just stick a few leaves in there. Yeah, that's kind of big. So we want maybe something little. That's a pretty one right there, that Ooh, maroon color. That oh, and the yellow is. too. They're both pretty. Oh, they're both very, this one kind of blends a little bit too much though. What do you guys think? Does that blend in too much? It, yeah, I think so. Yeah, these, these right here, they really stand out. What do you think? They don't have any stems on them though. Is that okay? That's fine. Stick okay. them to the rope. Okay. Yeah. Let's stick Might be them. better that they don't have stems. Yeah. So we'll just glue them right there maybe. Yeah. You think right over there, just a couple there. Are you seen there? I don't know. Can you there. can you there guys you see go. that? There you go. Yeah. yeah. Maybe a couple of leaves. Yeah. Let's put a few leaves on there. Okay. Not a whole lot. We yeah. don't want it to look like a big bag of leaves. No. We no, we don't. So we have a couple yeah. of big ones, a little one. Why don't we you want... stack them? Like yeah. you like we did that last one we did. That one we have a little stem on. It. Yeah. Maybe we can. There you go. Okay. That's, that looks good. Let's try that. Just kind of glue them on top of each other yeah. and stick them in there. Yeah, let's let's do that. So I don't know about y'all, but my leaves are falling. My oh, not on. sweet gum is not, is it not um, working? No, it's not. For some oh, reason. you know what? It's unplugged right here. It's been pulled too hard. Oh. Look down there on the floor. Yeah, hang on. I'm going Technical, to go under the table. Technical difficulties. Our hot glue gun got unplugged. <laughs> I don't see the cord. Oh, is that the cord over there? Yes, that's it. Okay, I'm there sorry. we go. Now we have we have the cord now. Okay, there we go. Okay, Ugh. now it'll take just a second. <laughs> so glad y'all didn't see me get up off the ground. <laughs> Looked a lot like a spider. <laughs> graceful as we used to be. <laughs> I don't think I ever was graceful anyway. Oh. But my gosh, how did that floor get so far down? <laughs> okay. Let's see here. It's, it's getting heated up there. Okay. There's some little bitty ones. Do you want to oh, something those that are small? Cute too. They're not shiny though. Okay. They don't have glitter. All right. I think this calls for glitter. All right. We, we need some glittery. Let's glitter. Okay. All right, let's see. And how far over do we want to do this? Maybe right about there would look good on that rope. We'll just put a big blob of glue. Whew, really did get warm or cold. It doesn't take long warm, for that cold. glue gun. If y'all are ever in the, the in the need for a glue gun, this one is called Super Binder, and it's a cordless glue gun. Yeah. Um, you can get it at it's Hobby awesome. Lobby, or if you want to go cheaper, you can go to Amazon, Amazon. and get it quite cheaper than you do at awesome, Hobby yeah. Lobby. You just have to put it back on the base every so often. Yeah, but it, it'll, it'll, go it long, it'll go a pretty long time without yeah. putting it back on that base, so we highly yeah. recommend that's Super Binder. Oh yeah, that's good. That's really good. Now do one on the other side. Yes, kinda. over here. Okay, yeah. do we want to do one big glittery one, or what do we want to do? I kind of like the way you stack those. Stack them? Okay. Let's stack a few more. What do we think? Now, you guys can decorate out of the, since it's empty up here, you can decorate out of the top however you want. Um, ooh, I kind of like this green one up there. Okay, so.
So we've got three dollars in here plus a little bit of jute rope. Um, and oh, that is pretty. And you could do ribbon. Like that. Uh, ribbon would be pretty. Um, I just wanted it to cover up the, the crack. That's all you need it for. And then whatever you put on the top. Um, if you like our crafts and you're watching us on Facebook, please go up and hit the follow button and you'll always know when we're fixing to be on. Or if you're watching us on YouTube, please subscribe and hit the bell. And if you'll do that, you also will know where we are. I can't make up my mind. <laughs> we are on um, oh, that's really pretty. That's Instagram really pretty. and Twitter. Yes. So visit us there. Okay, I've You just can't mind. get rid it's of these, us. These two. We've yeah, those are pretty. Two. Okay, so we're going to stack them. Yeah. Oh, okay. like that. That's pretty. Yep. We're going to stack them like that. Yeah, a little bit blue. And right Pinterest. There. I forgot we're on Pinterest. And now Pinterest. Too. Yes, she has us on everything. <laughs> we're, yeah. We do our videos on Pinterest. Yes. So visit us there, too. Yep. Okay. You are thinking, where are they not? We, she tries to have us everywhere. It's awesome. Okay. Let's just put a big bunch of glue right there, maybe. And there we go. Okay. I think that's good. Good. Okay. okay. Now Vonda's gonna decorate. So now the I top just have it. leftover flowers left over from yep the thing that we did, but these came from the Dollar Tree too. They all came a bunch. Oh, it came off. Did I squish it off? Oh, no, I'm sorry. I think it. No, you didn't do it. It just I didn't well, get put it that on down there. that I didn't do something this time. Yeah, she didn't. No, <laughs> it was me. I didn't get it on there. Good. That's okay. <laughs> Just should have held it a little bit longer. Now, with the rocks in the bottom, it makes it stable enough that mm -hmm. the wind can catch it and not just, right. you're not going to be chasing it all the time. Okay. Maybe that's all. But we're going to kind of lay it back a little bit. So you guys so can, you can see. see. Yes. Thankful, grateful, and blessed. Yes. And we totally are. That's right. And we are blessed that y'all watched us today. Yes. And we thank you so much for doing thank that. Thank you. Um, if, if you would give us some love, do you like it? Do you love it? Yeah. Give us love if you do. We appreciate it. Yes. We also always read our comments. Yes. So if you have a question or if you just want to make a suggestion on what we should have done. Right. Or go for another for craft. It. That's right. Would you like we'll us to try? To. Yeah. Yes. But we thank you. If you're watching us yes. on replay, hit hashtag replay. Right. That way you know, we know that you've been here and watched right. us. All right. Well, we thank y'all so much. Thank this was you. a fast one, but for a Tuesday, you just can't beat it. That's right. Thank y'all. Love you so one much. another. Love one another. Bye. Bye. -bye.